Hey everyone, we are at another So Blue Dolly Sunday. Um, so this is the only tag that I've ever really done, and I've been doing it consistently, so I wanted to keep that going. Hi guys, I'm right here. Um, but I have a surprise for you guys. It's going to be a blanket reveal right underneath this blanket. I have a surprise, but first I want to talk to you guys about a few things. Okay, so, uh, where is it? Okay, I'm losing stuff already, guys. Oh, I found it. Okay. So, this message is really just for Lynn over at My Bella Blessing. If you're watching this, I just wanted to talk to you about something. Okay, so she won the giveaway, and I am getting her stuff ready. Um, however, I realized that I do not have another Dumbo clip. The one I had, the, the Dumbo pacifier clip that I made is sold but I didn't have another Dumbo charm except for this one, which as you can see, if you guys can see that, hold on. There it is. It looks sunburned. It's not even a really nice pink. It's a weird pink and it looks weird. Um, but this was the only one I had. So I went on a hunt for another Dumbo charm and I checked both Walmarts in my town. I checked Hobby Lobby, you know. Um, I checked Amazon and AliExpress. Now, AliExpress, I could probably find something that would work, but it will take over a month to get here from China. So, I went on Amazon, and I did find something that would work. It won't be here till, I think, Thursday, it said? Tuesday or Thursday, one of those. Um, so, hopefully, once that's here, that will work, and I could get your pacifier clip put together and I will send off your prize so yeah that's the delay that I'm having to deal with but hopefully we can be patient <laughs> I'm impatient I like to do stuff and get it done 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 but um yeah so that's what I'm dealing with so it but it's coming a lot faster because it's coming from Amazon so it should be here soon I can get that sent out for you but isn't this weird, guys? Come on. That's weird. I didn't want to send you that. That's that's weird. Okay. So, let's move along. Let's talk about something else. Okay. Um, and I will be doing a collaboration with um, Thomason's Once Upon a Dot 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 Nursery. So, I will link her channel in the description box below. We are going to be doing a collab soon. It's going to be huge. It's going to be fun. Everybody is invited. Okay. So, I wanted to show you guys some things that I picked up at Marshall's yesterday in clearance. First, I got this really nice pink. Oh, you hear the kids, guys? They're screaming in the next room. They're watching SpongeBob. I got this on clearance for six bucks. It's Mon Lapin. I don't know if you guys know that brand, but it's a really soft pink blanket, and I really like this color pink. So, I grabbed it, and then I got this blanket. It was also on clearance for six dollars, and it has like this almost rose like fluff swirls can you guys see that and then it has like little pale blue stars all over it really soft really pretty six bucks can't go wrong okay the next thing I got at Marshall's the tags are stuck together it was on clearance for seven dollars and it is I think it's three to six months yeah three to six months it's um Emily and Oliver, but it has this really cool rainbow on it, which I really like, and it's like a mint green color. It has this lace detail, which is really pretty. And now that I have some bigger girls, I figure this would be perfect for that. Um, so yeah, got that. And then I got this. Um, it wasn't on clearance, but it was only $7.99, and I thought it was really pretty. It's got strawberries on it. It's like a light pink, pink strawberry that comes with the headband. has a bow on the front. And I figure um, this is a zero to three. But um, it might fit um, some of my newborn babies um, with a onesie. Like maybe a white onesie underneath. Something like that. I thought that was really pretty. So I went ahead and got it. Okay. And then I got these bows on clearance um, for three bucks. And I really like them. They got like the beige um, wrap. And then there's different ones. So I thought that was cute. So I went ahead and got those for three bucks. Yeah, I'll take it. 
Okay, and then the last thing I got, uh, well, I want to show you these two things first. I got these on clearance at um, Walmart. They were marked down from like 15 bucks to 5 Um, There's two. This is um, newborn size, and I got one in three to six months size. And this is like a gingham, but it's in a like a lavender color, like a mauvey purple. And then this one has like a texture to it, if you guys can see that. Do you guys see that? I don't know what to call that fabric, but I like it. And it has the... And I really like the fact that it doesn't have foot feeties in it. Because sometimes you want to put like fancy booties or socks on your baby. So I really like the sleepers that don't have the feet in them. But um, yeah, I got two sets because I'm sharing with a friend. So you'll probably see these over on her channel too. <laughs> um, and then you'll know who it is. It's a secret. It's a huge secret. No, I'm just kidding. And then I got this at Marshall's. What were they? They were on clearance for $8. There's two of them. And these are newborn size. There's a string. These are newborn size. And actually, I'm going to be using these today for So Blue Dolly Sunday. This one has the palm trees with the sunshine, some flying birds. Really pretty pale blue. I really like this color blue. It's almost periwinkle, but not. It's not purple. It is blue. Okay, so I'm going to be using that today for So Blue Dolly Sunday. Those are the outfits. So let's do the blanket reveal. You ready, guys? <clears throat> so let's do the bottom first. What? You see a pink blanket and a blue one. What could be under here? What could it be? Here we go. Okay, so these are my twins, guys. Okay, so these are kits that I got on AliExpress. They were already pre-painted. Oh, I'm bumping the camera. They were pre-painted, but here's the thing. I doctored them up. I made one clearly a girl and one clearly a boy. Um, what I did to them, I'm going to show you each one of them. So for her, what I did was I... Put some color around her eyes and I'm going to be putting um, a whole bunch of pictures at the end of this video showing you details and showing you what they look like before. In fact, I'll pop a picture up right here on the screen. That is the kit before I doctored it. Okay, so I added color to the lips. I added color around the eyes. I added some dark brown eyelashes to her. Let's take her little hat off and I'll show you. I just really love how these babies turned out. Um, hold on. Here we go. I put this little bonnet on her. I thought it was so cute. And it matches the little bloomers she's wearing with lace. Isn't she pretty? And I put this crocheted um, sweater on her. This, this sweater was made by... I'm going to add buttons to it. But this sweater was made by um, Donna over at Nana's Crafty Corner that's her channel name um i she had uh you guys i gotta go see what's wrong with the baby i will be right back flynn is calling mama all right guys i am back that baby was mad he didn't want to be in his playpen so yeah he got mad flynn is my little velociraptor if you guys haven't noticed so they came with painted hair on the kit and I'll show you on him because I didn't doctor his hair but I did doctor hers. So I went over the painted hair with my Prisma pencil and I sealed it. So I did a few different colors. I did some baby hairs on the front. If you guys can see that. So I went ahead and doctored that. I darkened inside of the ears a little bit because there wasn't enough color to my liking on there. I used Prisma Pencil. Um, and I told you about the lips. They're all sealed. And she has the dark brown eyelashes. Now, she is so pretty. I just can't get over these little faces. Now, they came with really plain um, pacifiers. So what I did was... I made them their own pacifiers with magnets. There's a magnet. I don't like to put felt over my magnets anymore because it weakens them. So I just do it like that. And hers has, let me see if you can see that. These are dandelions on it and it's blue. And I give them matching Tommy to be 
pacifiers. His has a little bear on it with a bow tie. If you guys can see that, the light's kind of bright. There's the magnet. Now let's go over his, what I did to him. Come here, buddy. Okay, so here he is. He's very cute. Little cute face. Now I did his lips too, but I didn't do them as dark. Because he's the boy. And for his eyelashes, I did light the lightest brown I had. Um, because I wanted him to have pretty boy eyelashes, but I didn't want them to be too dark. Um, to make him look too girly. Because he's a boy. He's all boy. And I doctored around the eye, painted it a little bit, darkened inside his ear. Let me show you his hair. Now his hair is the hair that they came with. I, oops, bumping the camera. I did not doctor his hair at all. And that's the hair that they came painted with. It's not bad. It's fine. I might doctor it in the future. We don't know. But yeah, so that is, so this is Maverick and um, her name is Magdalena. So it's Mav and Meg. And I thought that went good with them. They're so cute. Like I can't get over how cute they turned out. Um, and they both have um, matching booties with matching hats that match their booties. That are crocheted. I got those at the thrift store one day in a bag. Um, someone had made them. Knitted them, I think. Actually, I think they're knitted, not crocheted. Very. There's his little hat. And then I have this um, little jacket with a seal on it on him. It's not like a jacket, it's like a shirt, but I'm using it as a jacket. Got. I'm going to show you their hands. They have really cute little hands. And um, we're going to get them all dressed for So Blue Dolly Sunday. Hopefully I said that right. <laughs> and um, they're going to be wearing these outfits, like I said. So I wanted to show you guys what I made for them today. So I made them pacifier clips. I did his with a hippo and some wooden beads and some glass beads. I thought that would look good for him. And for her, hair. My hair is always everywhere, guys. Sorry. Um, for her, I did an uh, elephant, and there's little tiny flowers on the elephant's ear. Hopefully you guys can see that. Hold on. There we go. Focus. And I did her a couple different types of pink, beads, wooden, and glass. So there's her pacifier clip. So they both have their own pacifier clips. And, um... I'll show you me putting it on his pacifier. And yes, bears and hippos go together, guys. Come on. They're best friends. The best friends. Okay, so. This, oh, I'm not even on the screen. So, so if you ever buy a pacifier clip from me, this is how you do it. You put the, that through. And then um, just feed this through. You can do it on any hole that's on the pacifier. And then there it is. That's how you put it on. Isn't that cute? Um, if you have another way that you can do it, and then when, because there's something glued here, I don't want it to come off, I push, I hold the bottom and then I push from the back like that so that that doesn't come loose. See that? That's how we do it. So that's for him. And then hers is the elephant, like I said. And I put some blue in hers too, of course. I disliked it and I thought it would match her pacifier a little better. And this pacifier is like a it's a little bit of a teal blue. That's okay though. I'm not too matchy matchy anyway. But um yeah, there we go. There is that. So I'm gonna get them changed. Um let me focus the camera so I'm gonna get them changed guys um, you guys can watch me change them I'm gonna put music over this part and fast forward it so that it doesn't take as long because I've already been talking for a few minutes so you guys can enjoy that and then there's gonna be a huge picture dump at the end because I've had these babies for a few days now put together and they're so cute I kept taking pictures of them so there's going to be a bunch of pictures at the end, which I will also post on Instagram. So if you want to see them more, go to my Instagram. But these are the twins, and I'm so happy to introduce them to you. Okay, here we go, guys.
All right, guys. So there they are. This is her teddy that I gave her. I still have to get a lovey for her. But this also goes for So Blue Dolly Sunday because this baby has a blue bow and blue hearts on it. And um, here comes Maverick. There's Mavi. Um, let me move her over. Guys, snuggling together, guys. Aren't they cute? Actually, I think I like him better on this side. I know, that's weird. But what's funny about these two is, like, I feel like even though they're the same kit, like, she looks, like, totally like a girl, and he looks totally like a boy. I just, I love this kit. It's very versatile. Um, they're super cute, though. Like, let me put something behind their head so you guys can see them better. Um, come on, get your heads up, guys. But, um, yeah, I just, and the way he just looks up at you, it's like they're the same, but they're different. And <laughs> it's, I know, it's weird, but I just think they're so adorable. These are two really sweet babies. What is wrong with her magnet today? I think this is pulling it. You're twisting your magnet. Here, let's do it that way. There we go. Um, but yeah, I really like them. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really hope you guys like my new twins. Please come see them over on Instagram. Um, and uh, enjoy some pictures that I've taken um, since I've made them. And when I was making them. Because I have some like side-by-side -side pictures of like before and afters of why when I was making them so I hope you guys will enjoy this and uh, stay stay here and watch these pictures if you're interested otherwise head over to my Instagram because I'll post some there and thank you for joining me today we'll see you next time bye guys